So, pre-wash on your washing machine. What is it and how do we use it? Today I am going to explain it all for you. So, first of all, pre-wash is an extra cycle that you can add at the front of your washing machine program in addition to the full program you have selected to go here. So, this cycle lasts... Uh, it varies actually. Mine lasts a whole uh, 40 minutes here, so you can see. So this isn't really for quick wash, this is made for the longer washes. And what it does is that it helps clean really dirty clothes. For example, if you are a mechanic and you get a lot of oil on your clothes, or a chef for that matter, if you go sport, go sports, <laughs> if you are a football player, you have very sweaty clothes for example, uh, pre-wash can help hair as well. It essentially extends the length of our wash, but it also allows us to add more cleaning products if we want to. As pre-wash has its own slot in the washing machine tray here, you can see pre-wash, wash and softener. This is really cool because we can actually add different things into this pre-wash tray. For example, if you have an enzyme based uh, stain remover, pop it in here. It's great. OxyClean, fantastic option. But you can also just use regular detergent and pop it in here to add a little bit extra cleaning power to your cycle. Now, I will say one thing though, it is not essential to add any product to the tray. It pre-wash on its own, just with water, it's totally fine. It's gonna help and loosen up that smell, the grime, just loosen it up before the normal programs with all the detergent and other additives uh, comes into play. So let's take a look at how to actually do this here. So like I said, you don't need any Anything, but you can add some uh, pre-wash. I just brought out some detergent here. Now I have some uh, regular powder detergent, so I'm just gonna add a little bit for the demonstration here. Just remember that you don't have to do this. There we go. I'm washing a lot of towels here. There was a party here this weekend and uh, yeah, something spilled, to put it like that. Here we have the detergent tray. I'm gonna flip this up because we are using powder detergent. Just leave that laying down if you're using uh, liquid. Uh, that is one thing to note about the pre-wash as well. Uh, if you use liquid uh, cleaning products in the pre-wash, it's gonna slide down faster. So that is something to keep in mind. Generally, it's not a problem since you're loading it in now and you're gonna start the washing machine anyway. But if you pre-load this a while before and then all the detergent or um, liquid cleaning product slides into the drum, it's not that good. So yeah, keep that in mind. So let's add some detergent here as well, like that. And I think this is a lot of towels, so I am going to add a little bit of fabric softener into the mix here as well. As you can see, I haven't loaded a lot of detergent in here. That is, since I already used the pre-wash, I don't really feel it's necessary in my instance. But feel free to add a little bit more, just don't overdo it, uh, as that's going to lead to having extra like detergent marks on your clothes. Also, it's not good for your washer. Anyway, let's close this up now. I've loaded up with towels, close the door and I've turned on my washing machine. The next step that I like to do is to pick my program. Today we're just gonna do, let's do just regular cottons and I'm gonna turn it down to 40 degrees. Pre-wash temperature depends a little bit on your washer. Generally cold pre-wash, totally fine. We're gonna do 40, however. Also, we turn on pre-wash on my washer right there. As you can see there, the time is added and we are ready to turn on the washer. So now what's gonna happen is, it, is that it's gonna go through its pre-wash process, then it's gonna go through the regular washing process, and then we are ready to take the towels out and put them in a dryer. I've made videos on this in the past, so I'm gonna link that here if you wanna see how to dry your clothes. Also, I'm doing a bunch more videos on these washing machine programs, so if you want to see that, make sure to subscribe. I'm gonna add a link here to the next one, which is pretty cool. And yeah, I hope this was helpful, and I'll see you over there.